Ladies and gentle courts. Gentle courts. Gentle courts. Gentle court collaborations. Hello, I'm Victor Frost, audio engineer for My Little Pony, Love is Magic. In this session, I'll help you get prepared to record your audition. For any budding voice actor, having the proper equipment is key. <laughs> you can't very well record a great audition if your microphone is crap. There's only so much audio engineers can do to clean up bad audio. As the saying goes, garbage in, garbage out. So to make sure that your audition won't be thrown out with the trash, watch this video and the microphone technique video. Now, let's get started. Whether voice acting is just a hobby, or if you plan on making a career out of it, a good microphone is the first step towards making your audition real. For beginning hobbyists, or people who can't dedicate a ton of money towards equipment, I recommend the Blue Snowflake. It's available for $49 on Amazon, and it's the mic I use when I'm on the go or otherwise can't be bothered to use my fancy equipment. Alternatively, there's also the Q2U Recording Pack by Samson. This set ranges between $57 and $100, depending on where you buy it. But the difference is that, while they're both USB mics, the Samson comes with a set of headphones that plug directly into the microphone for live monitoring as well as having an XLR output useful for when you want to bump up your equipment. In either case, the key is having a microphone with a USB connection. Not having to go through your computer's sound card does wonders for giving you clean audio. For the aspiring professional, there's really only one important question. Firewire or USB? If you don't have a Firewire port in your computer, then I recommend the PreSonus AudioBox Studio. It's the complete recording package with USB audio interface, studio microphone, monitor headphones, and a recording software all for $250. All you need to get is a microphone stand which can be had for as little as $10. If you have a Firewire port available, then I recommend my setup a PreSonus Fire Studio Mobile, and a Shure SM57 microphone. What monitor headphones you get are up to you, but the interface and the mic together cost me about $300. Now you might wonder why you'd want to spend $50 more than the USB option and not even get headphones. While PreSonus is a great company, Shure is THE industry name for high quality microphones. The SM57 has been used by every president since its introduction in 1965, and this setup will last you for years, proving itself to be a great investment in your voice acting career. Next up is your recording environment. It goes without saying that, to get the best recording, you need a quiet place to record where you can be loud if you need to be. If you live by yourself, this is no problem. If you live with other people, then try to schedule a time where everyone can get out and leave you alone. Once you have the place to yourself, just close up your windows and doors, turn off any fans, air conditioners, or pretty much anything else that'll make some noise, and you'll be fine. Finally, the software. If you can afford it, buy Adobe Audition. It's what I use. If you can't, just download Audacity. They're both relatively easy to learn. That's all for the Getting Started session. Don't forget to listen to the Microphone Techniques session for more help on recording your audition.